all right guys traveling blade here back again for another vlog back again for another away vlog today all the way down at kenilworth road for luton away luton sat just above the relegation zone actually have played a game less than us i think and seem to be scoring for fun at the minute so god help us we're coming off the back of an absolutely catastrophic 5-0 loss at home to Villa, which was an absolute disgrace. I thought we initially picked up a bit under Wilder, kept ourselves in games, but given the showing last Saturday, we're right back to where we were under Hecky at Burnley away. So it's going to be a right belt of a day. To be fair, it should be a good day out, but it's off to a flying start. I've cut myself shaving and the train from Sheffield to Donny has been cancelled. Um, but shout out to Lewis Taylor. <laughs> He's got his mum to give us a lift to Donny. Thank God for that. So yeah, off to a flying start already. And that's before a ball's been kicked. I ain't got a clue what's gonna happen today. I'm just so worried that they're scoring for fun. I think they've scored eight goals in their last two games in the league at least. <laughs> We've, we're shipping goals like they're going out of fashion. So, Christ, I think my up slight blend of optimism and maybe realistic is a 3-1 defeat um, but who knows what the score is going to be with United hopefully hopefully we can salvage a point not that that's going to do us any good at this point of the season this no, way to me and then put it next no, to the window put no. your back of the phone on the window and knock on the window and answer it turns around <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> yeah. He knows what's happening. He knows what's happening. We've got him. Fucking what's it? Yes, lads. Cheers, ginger nuts. Two or four. Cheers, ginger nuts. Two or ginger nuts. Two. Fucking drugs. Marsh. Marsh. <laughs> No messes, regulars only. Cheers, mate. Goodbye. <laughs> right, three spares for Bournemouth. Who's booking on? Cheers. That's it. <laughs> 50 quid. Comes a good in. Come on. 3-0 Luton, half time. 
Back at bus by our fucking three. I don't know. Shambles. Jack Robinson! Jack Robinson! Jack Robinson! Jack Robinson! Jack Robinson! Jack Robinson! Jack Robinson!
United 3. We have won away in the league and we have dragged ourselves kicking and screaming over Derby's record lowest points tally. We've finally made it past, was it 11 points they had? 
Christ Almighty, there was a, a few times where I was beginning to worry, um, particularly early on in the season. <laughs> but fair play to Wilder. I know beforehand I was saying yeah. we're right back to where we were under Hecky when we lost 5 0 um, away to Burnley. And that's honestly how I felt leaving the game after you know the defeat to Aston Villa. But yesterday, Yes, we didn't have much possession, but who gives a shit? We won 3-1. We won 3-1. We scored some brilliant goals. No one was a penalty, but the first one was a brilliant. The uh, the run the run and the finish by Archer, who had missed a really good chance moments before, but made more than amends with the fact. A brilliant run from him, pushed the, the physicality from him to uh, bully the other player out of the way, and then run through, and then a cool finish at the near post. And then obviously um, Suza as well, once again brilliant um, defensively for us, winning all the headers at the back. And with a brilliant finish as well, coming forward, coolly taken with a good finish, getting the goal in front of the away end as well. What a game he had, fair play to the lad. Um, I was a bit of a slow burner on Suza, but he's definitely becoming a, one of our better players so far and a bit of a fan's favourite, so fair play to him. Um, but yeah, honestly, what a fantastic day, away day down in Luton. We were determined to enjoy ourselves, whatever the result. But the fact we've actually got a 3-1 win away from home, away from home, and we are over the flipping record low points. Thank Christ for that. We are still going to have to pull off the miracle of all miracles to stay up. We are now level on points with Burnley, but our torrid goal difference means we are still bottom for now. We have got Brighton, uh, Brighton at home next week. Hopefully, because we had our fingers burnt so badly in the cup game, we are a bit more switched on with this one. And maybe let's see if we can just get a point and just see as much as we can do and see where it takes us. But hopefully this gives us a little bit of a lifeline and a, a big confidence boost. A couple of players getting more got Archer scoring again. McAtee getting the penalty. Obviously, Souza getting a goal. Um, Brewster coming back on. One downside is RND off injured again. I believe he left in tears. Does not look good does not look good that is one of the downsides um but overall a fantastic day and let's just hope this gives us a confidence boost and something to build on we pull off the impossible we will only find out but whatever happens we're not going to finish with the lowest points ever and we've won away and we've still got what a brilliant day yesterday was anyway guys i'm in the traveling blade and i'll see you for brighton at home